Let's take a brief tour of the eCRAN interactive demo. We'll start by analyzing the activity of monitored users. You can browse their sessions on the Monitoring Results page. Here, you can find particular sessions using various filters or using the search box. For example, let's find a session with user activity in the registry. In the session player, you can view context-rich recordings and highlighted alerts triggered during this session. A user-friendly interface makes interacting with the system intuitive, even if it's your first time using the management tool. Let's take a closer look at the capabilities of the session player. You can set the speed at which a session is played back and view detailed data from the player using the magnifying glass. The Tools menu allows you to perform a forensic export of the session, save a screen capture, and get the URL of the current moment in the session. You can choose the monitor to display. Now let's get back to the session list and try out the filters. Suppose you only need to review Linux sessions. In this case, you can filter by operating system. You can view both SSH and X Window System X11 sessions. Next up, the Report Generator page. Here you can find different user activity reports that contain crucial data for analyzing users' behavior. Samples of the reports are displayed so you don't need to generate a report to view its structure. Now let's look at the interactive monitoring page. Here you can define users, clients, and the time period for displaying and generating charts showing how much time employees spent in each application and on each website. You can also view a list of sessions containing the target application or URL. For example, let's click the mmc.exe column. We can see the list of sessions where this application was used. Another important incident response tool is the Actionable Alert System. On the Alert Management page, you can see predefined alerts. They're really easy to use. Let's try to configure a default alert on running one of the command line programs. First, we'll define the risk level. Then we'll add the required clients. For example, let's select all clients. After that, we'll specify actions that will be performed if the alert is triggered. That's it, the alert is configured. You can now create your own custom alerts and edit existing alerts. Let's continue to the user management page. Here you can see users who have access to the management tool. You can manage individual users or add users to groups for convenience. Permissions granted to users can be edited at any time. Just click Edit User and make the necessary changes. Onto the Client Management page, you can find endpoints with the installed clients. You can configure eCRAN system clients to optimally record user activity. For example, you could define recording frequency and screenshot settings to adjust the amount of monitored data and hence the volume of traffic. Additionally, you can define applications whose data will be skipped during monitoring. Let's monitor all data except data from applications containing DOC in the title. You can set up IP filtering to monitor only third-party vendors or third-party users. To do this, select Monitor Activity from all remote public IP addresses except and define the IP addresses of internal users' computers whose sessions must be skipped. Now, onto the Access Management page. Here you can define access restrictions for users. For example, you can allow access to an endpoint only during specific hours or only upon approval by the security department. This helps you organize just-in-time access to critical endpoints. Let's look at more features of the eCRAN system. On the Configuration page, for example, you can configure integration with SIEM systems and define all log format settings. You can integrate eCRAN system with target domains by specifying the LDAP path and credentials of a domain user. On the Customization tab, you can customize emails and reports with your company name and logo. Next, let's go to the Management Tool log page. Here you can see a specific type of log for all actions performed by eCRAN system users within the Management Tool. This helps you track access to security monitoring records and protect your system from intrusions. The Health Monitoring page helps you monitor the system's health and react to any problems in a timely manner. For example, you can analyze database storage usage 
and errors occurring in the ECRAN system. You can also configure notifications in case errors occur. Another important page is the Offline Clients page. It shows you all clients that are offline for more than a specified period of time. This helps you detect when critical endpoints are disconnected and react to such incidents quickly. Finally, let's check out the Password Management page. Here you can see, add, and edit secrets. Let's suppose you need to provide access to a root account. You can add a required secret and share it with the necessary person who needs access. Now he or she can access the critical endpoint without knowing the password. As you can see, eCRAN system password management is a light PAM solution. We've reviewed all the main features of eCRAN system. If you have any questions or would like more detailed information, please email us at sales at ecransystem.com.